Well, different groups marched for different causes today, and there were also groups marching for the same cause, but with differing ideas on how to achieve their goals. KTLA's Chip Yost talked to organizers of two different groups, and both are pushing for immigration reform, but they have very different views. When you organize marches like this, with signs and images like these, and you call for the legalization of millions of illegal immigrants, you're bound to be called a lot of things by people who don't agree. Compañeros. Just ask Juan Jose Gutierrez of the Full Rights for Immigrants Coalition. I've been called every name on the book, you know, from extremist, you know, radical, Marxist, communist, uh, a Democrat. But one thing Gutierrez isn't used to is being called soft or not radical enough in his calls for change, which is basically what the Southern California Immigration Coalition has said about it. We generally don't think they're going far enough in what they're asking for. They're out there to get votes for the Democratic Party. We're here to pressure the Democratic Party, and if the Democratic Party doesn't keep their promises, we will lead a national campaign to boycott the Democratic Party or any politician who does not support legalization. So Ron Gochez and his Southern California coalition got a separate permit to hold a separate march, marching just a little bit behind Gutierrez and his coalition. And while on paper, the differences between the two groups don't look that big, Gochez says they are. We represent a clear political message, and the message we're sending is if Obama and the Democratic Party, if they want to get reelected, they need to come through with their promises of immigration reform. Do you find it kind of funny you're all of a sudden not radical enough? <laughs> yeah, I find it uh, uh, very funny, but of course, you know, that's not really the issue. The issue is how are we going to go about uh, getting immigration reform? As a result of the two different groups getting two different permits, at the end of the march, one of the groups had to have its rally right down there near 4th and Broadway, while the other group had to have its rally right over here a few blocks away. In downtown, I'm Chip Yost, KTLA News.